Minister of State for IT Rajiv Chandra Shekhar told Money Control that the draft bill for the Digital India Act is expected to be ready by March end. The draft would then undergo a 90-day period of feedback and consultation. Chandra Shekhar said, adding that this process could be completed by June 29th. The Act will regulate different categories of platforms differently. He stated, Actor Chunky Pandey recalled the first time he met the late actor Satish Kaushik. I was a struggling actor. We met on the sets of Mr. India where I was assisting to get work. I remember meeting Satish ji very vividly because he was so encouraging towards me, he stated. Satish passed away aged 66 after suffering a heart attack. Actress Sabha Azad who is said to be dating Hrithik Roshan, said that people taking more interest in her personal life than her professional life, bothers, her. A lot. For long, women have been seen as a means to facilitate the men in their lives. That is a universal phenomenon. That is a product of patriarchy, she said. Actor Ram Charan has revealed that he's in talks for his first ever Hollywood project. The talks are happening and how they're gonna transcend it into a movie and may walking to a set is news that's gonna come out in a couple of months, he added. Ram featured in S.S. Rajamouli's RRR, which also starred Junior NTR and Alia Bhatt. RRR, actor Ram Charan. While speaking about attending the 95th Academy Awards, revealed his father Chiranjeevi was sentimental before Charan's flight. He has been to the Oscars in the 80s, that too for an appearance and that also he felt was a huge achievement, he stated. But today we've been nominated and on the list and now waiting, Charan added. Capital Markets Regulator SEBI on Thursday introduced a reward system for up to 20 lakh rupees to informants for sharing information about the assets of defaulters. The regulator issued a list of 515 defaulters about whom information can be provided by any informant. SEBI said the amount of reward granted to informant will be paid from investor protection and Education Fund The forests in Karnataka have recorded more than 2,042 fire incidents since February 15. According to data shared by the State Forest Department, of these, 627 have been large-scale forest fires. Delayed release of funds from the Union Government have caused huge losses already, the Janata Dal. Secular Party said in a tweet. Waras Punjab the Chief Amritpal Singh's close aide Gurinder Pal Singh Ojla was detained by airport authorities at Amritsar Airport after he allegedly tried to flee to UK. A lookout circular was earlier issued by Jalandhar police for Ojla, who reportedly handled social media of pro Khalistan slain militant Jarnal Singh Bindram Wales. Follow a Singh. Ojla has been handed over to the police. A local Samajwadi party leader, Naseem Khan, was found dead under mysterious circumstances in Uttar Pradesh's Mao late Wednesday night. The 45-year-old had reportedly gone to a friend's place for a holy party. His health suddenly deteriorated and he was taken to a hospital where doctors declared him dead. Police said. Google CEO Sundar Pichai recently claimed the company's desk sharing policy for the cloud units. Employees is not only to save resources but also to stop the office from looking like a ghost town. Google had rolled out a new desk sharing program at five of its locations. 
Pichai also tried to encourage employees to better utilize the resources on offer. Defending IPL champions Gujarat Titans on Thursday unveiled their new jersey for IPL 2023. The jersey includes a star above Gujarat Titans logo. Proud to have a star on our jersey. The much-loved jersey is back with enhancements that display our winning attitude, Gujarat Titans. Tweeted. Table toppers Mumbai Indians. Me. Chased down a target of 106 in 90 deliveries against Delhi Capitals. DC. To register their third victory in a row in Women's Premier League. WPL. 2023. Me bowled DC out for 105 runs in 18 overs. With Sika Ishak. Isi Wong and Haley Matthews taking three wickets each. Yastaka Bhatia top scored for me with 41. 32. The California man who won $2.04 billion. Over 16,000 crore rupees. Powerball jackpot. Believed to be the largest lottery jackpot in world history. Has spent $25.5 million. Over 200 crore rupees. On a mansion. The property that Edwin Castro bought has five bedrooms and six bathrooms. It also has an infinity pool, a theater, a wine cellar, a game room and a gym.